you're in for it now, Tusked Bug Freaks. Hello again. Production complete. As with before, this is Hagu, returning to Office Centauri to resume bearing the torch for science! Uh-huh. The Isle of the Deep is really a single creature. We can make our own mind worms. Of individual well, tubing. sea worms. Just add salt water. Of the mind worms. Nah, shoot. Somebody's got to explain this worminess to us. <clears throat> yes, Jiko Shahago, I did say thought waves. Dr. Fedorov's wrinkled smile is otherworldly, a grinning death's head. The mind worms definitely, and probably the fungus itself. Even after transient human thought patterns are isolated, a complex wave dynamic remains, and there's good reason to believe that at least some mentation has taken place. You're telling me this stuff thinks. You say half-heartedly, not quite prepared to buy into the idea. If so, it's a remarkably different matter of thought from that of humans. But the basic cognitive feedback loop is present. Dr. Fedorov leans forward and gestures toward the graphic with his data link stylus. The most striking thing is the loop's ability to jump from creature to creature, each fungal spore acting as a synapse. The spores of worms as individual creatures are insignificant, but the feedback across a fungal bloom or a mindworm boil is impressive. How long can it keep jumping? Now your curiosity is piqued. Is it crossed the threshold into self-awareness? Difficult to say. In theory, a powerful wave could reverberate clear around the planet, but the distances involved would make true self-awareness problematic. Perhaps a quasi-sentient state, similar to our dreams. And without a moment to lose, Brother Doofus. My, 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 my. And give me cyber ethics. Small price to pay if it quiets him. Jeez. Suddenly a pact! And he wants to elect a uh, planetary leader. <laughs> it's good to be the king. I mean, it's it, it's good to have friends, yeah. Mm. Alright, here's some text that explains all the cool stuff I get as planetary governor, but the biggest thing is access to everybody's data links. That means I can tell how well anybody's doing economically. Uh, but most importantly, I can see what they're building. That gives me a general idea of how uh, everyone's progressing technologically, too. Hmm. Uh, Yang, I should uh, take a look at take a look at Yang's. Apparently, he is uh, building a massive army of missile infantry. It's also quite clear that he has the upper hand on the other alien faction. For now, I will continue my industrial preparations, making sure that my northern bases are um, well protected. Production Begin with sentient algorithms! Do you know what this means? It means it's time to build the Hunter Seeker algorithm. A secret project that makes me all but invincible against probe teams. Starting on Antarctica as, well, it can be largely safe from the thieving probe teams, but that isolation won't last forever. Anyway, look at all these lovely little supply crawlers. I mean, seriously, that's just... Huh, well, let's ignore this needle jet and base for now. Let's just say Yang is not happy about that foothold base. Very good. Dragon. Hey, hey, yeah! Well, I just told you about those supply crawlers, didn't I? Planet doesn't like him. <clears throat> Pop. Sudden darkness. This time you weren't even asleep. Ertagu. Damn it, voice! I am holding counsel! Stay out of my head! It is no longer possible to deny it. This cannot be a hoax. Either you have lost your final marble, or you have come into contact with some avatar of the native fungus. An alien sentience whose neural matrix may span the entire planet. More skilled we, yes, at this. Teach we much, Earth Hagu. Counsel never mind. Tugging we Hagu voice now. Orders giving. Ha ha! Joke we. Ha ha! Great. A sentient planet with the maturity of a crush infant. Make it quick, voice. Whatever it is you want. You... I try in my patience. Question we. Your human nodes together think yes? 
together think no flower synapse, worm synapse detect we not. Is there dependence? Each human is an independent creature. We can communicate by talking and writing, but we do not together think as you call it. Ah, most relieved we. Necessary pruning we several large infestations human nodes, harming they flower mind. Not wishing we deprive Earthagu of together thinking. Thank we, sorry bother we- Wait, voice! You can't just stop- Awkward silence around the council table. You quickly wipe the drool from your chin. Production complete. Well, none of that. Think you can stop me from building the Hunter Seeker algorithm, ha, huh, planet? Silly planet. Ah, uh, oh, sh- Um, yeah, when, uh, fungus blooms like this, that means that mind rooms aren't far behind. G give it a break, not the- not the supply crawlers. Bring on the vodka! The voice is gone! If I determine the enemy's disposition of forces while I have no perceptible form, I can concentrate my forces while the enemy is fragmented. The pinnacle of military deployment approaches the formless. If it is formless, then even the deepest spy cannot discern it, nor the wise make plans against it. Sun Tzu, The Art of War, Data Links. Production when I was a kid, this project movie was the coolest thing since GoldenEye 64. I wish I could talk like Production the narrator. To, uh, hello, what's this? Uh, oh jeez. I don't think I've ever gotten so close to zero credits before. What's going on? Huh, I'm only bringing in 26 credits per year. What happened? Well, it would appear I've got USA-like government spending problems. But not really, considering I'm spending so little on national defense. Anyway, I have the hunter-seeker algorithm, and troops are on the way to fortify the industrial powerhouse that is, uh, Baikonur. Hmm. Energy. Now, it seems kind of counterproductive for me to take bases off of, uh, stockpile energy, which turns a certain percentage of the minerals they mine into energy. But there are some base facilities that could get me more energy in the long run. A hydroponics lab could increase the workforce. What else do we got here? Uh... Oh, and this fusion lab would, uh... Oh, that's how I lost all my energy credits. <laughs> well, we recently discovered nuclear, uh... Nuclear fusion. And I upgraded a whole bunch of units to use new reactors. I guess I'll need to be more careful when we discover quantum energy. Well, shoot. Insufficient energy. Now what do I do? I got no money, yo! Project yeah, you initiated. build your hippie New Age Empath Guild. Production complete. Oh, Vikinger finishes its Centauri Preserve! Mm. How about that, planet? I have ordered these preserves set aside for you, voice. Planet life will remain completely undisturbed inside these compounds. Can you, in return, regulate your animal and plant vectors, keep them from overrunning my compounds? Mind and flower, node and worm, in compounds small planet years. Growth dream soon, unlock we prison. Human beware, planet risen! Like you poem we, Earthhagu. New human skill, learn me. Pretty dreadful, voice. What is this growth dream? You'll keep alluding to it. Growth dream soon is. Epochal blooming we. Mind and flower, dreaming we of great why. Earth humans, thoughts many. Make they growth dream sooner. Plant we many. many. Great pruning we of animal we. Also animal you. Beginning again of cycle. You mean this is going to wipe out most animal life on the planet, including all the humans? Not certain we. Never before this clearly think we. From humans learn we much, especially Earthhagu. Earthhagu friend we. We'll often remember we Earthhagu in next cycle. That's kind of you, voice. 
but it's not quite the kind of immortality I had in mind. Can't this process be slowed or stopped? Stop we know. Slow we, yes. In compounds stay we. Less harming cause you. Now, let, let us, us make, make you we more poems. Terraform completely. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is why the Centauri Preserve icon looks like a Production clock. Complete. Now, back to the nosy grindstone. <laughs> What a miserable base this be. But at least I can take pot shots of Yang from here. <laughs> Fire cannons! You again! And oh, so we advanced return again space to flight. The I thought I was riding high with a fusion laser weapon, but this. This has got to be light years ahead of Yang and the rest. The Plasma Shard Projector Device, a level 13 weapon! Missiles, may I inform you, are level 6. And, uh, the Fusion Laser was, uh, level 10. I'd like to start making foot soldiers equipped with the Plasma Shard, but... What do I do for the, uh, special ability? It doesn't look like I've got amphibious capabilities yet, so I guess I'll go for AAA tracking. I can't have my units bombed on by... You know what, th this was a stupid idea. AI players don't take advantage of the uh, aerial units in the field much anyway. Hmm. <sighs> I think we need a little more offensive power on the Northern Islands at the Little Gold. But eating up Yang's build cues is fun! Take that! Gates! You monopolistic madman! Just because you have money doesn't mean you should buy other people's bases. Oh, great. Oh, oh great. <laughs> ah, yes, Lau. Not right now, Lau. He paid for that mind control fair and square, Lau. Uh, do I want to move you? Not really. Oh, I built another one of those expensive skimships, apparently. Build something useful like, uh, like, uh, skunk works. Then you too can build the cool new prototypes at no extra cost. Now, oh, go north, young man. Why, well, shoot. I'll be back! It is altogether fitting that we who have sailed the deeps of space now return again to the sea. This is in many ways a water planet, and it can be ruled from the waves. With sea power, rugged terrain can be bypassed and enemy strongholds isolated. Once naval superiority is achieved, planet is ours for the taking. Colonel Corazon Santiago, Planet, a survivalist guide. Back with a vengeance. The more can you hear what may Planetary economics? Ah, uh, but anyway, that uh, maritime, maritime thingamajig ought to make my sea units a little faster, a little better, a little stronger. Kaboom! Project more complete. projects fall into my hands. <laughs> Two of them. My scientific and industrial clout is immense. Uh, well, is that is that silk steel?